Okie dokie, let's get started. All right, so let's go. Let's go. Okay, I have to send you the, the link to the dialogue. Just a second. Let's go. Let's go. So this dialogue is called grocery shopping. Do you remember this word grocery that we had last time when we read Grocious. the previous dialogue? Yes, I remember. I, I remember that when I said, Sasha, grocery is like a bad word, but it's not a bad word, right? Mm -hmm, right, Grocious. what's that? Yes, groceries is like, um, I don't know if I will say it correctly, but groceries is like uh, things to eat, but mm -hmm. it's not good for our health, right? They are good for us. I'm health. wrong, I'm wrong, <laughs> I'm wrong, all right. So groceries is the food yes. and other things for your home that you buy in a food store. Like, for example, mm -hmm. you go to the store, and you buy groceries. What do you buy in the store? When you go to the store, when you go to the supermarket, what do you buy? Food, right, in general. In general, food, yes. Oh, right, okay. Groceries is it's a kind of stores. Kind of what? Kind of stores. Or kind of markets. Um, what? <laughs> Markets. All right, let me tell you. No, no, okay, no. It's we not, have... It's not a kind of a market. It's no? all food. All food. All kinds of food. Like products. All oh, right, okay, like products. Okay, but mm -hmm. it's not okay, but it's not common to say, all right, I have my products. What is your products? Potatoes, um, vegetables, right? Okay, yes, I know. But the pronunciation of this word is groceries. Groceries. Woohoo, great. Groceries. Groceries. Perfect. Perfect. Yep. So this dialogue is about groceries. Yes, okay. Okay. Groceries. Let's listen to this dialogue. And while listening, you have to follow the script. <laughs> All right. Let's listen. Wow, it's uh, an advanced, uh, advanced dialogue. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try. I will help you. All right, okay. Okay, okay. you start. You start. I don't understand the dialogue. Why I have a problem. When I am here, this, the dialogue, I am trying to, to learn the pronunciation. And in this moment, I can't understand everything. Uh, it's different when I read some text because I am reading and me, I am thinking about only to read the text, right? Yeah, yeah, I understand this. This is great that you're saying this and because I can help you. So the point is you have to listen to this dialogue many times. Like the first thing, for example, is for you to hear the dialogue and to see what's going on over there, right? So kind of in general, right? So first of all, when you're listening, you're kind of thinking about it. You're imagining this dialogue, what's going on there? You're imagining their situation, okay, like in general. Basically, we have to listen to this dialogue and repeat. Therefore, it will be easier for us to understand all of the meaning, all of the words. So we'll go through the vocabulary and go through grammar, etc. Let's just read. And if you don't know any of the words, just ask me and we'll discuss them. Okay, let's, start. let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's start. Hey, uh, can you give me a hand with the gro groceries? And I told you I could do the shopping. Wow. Do we really need all this stuff? Let me see the receipt. I don't know what is this stuff. Stuff? <laughs> I stuff? Yes. It's all things we can call stuff. My, my books, my pens, my pencils, even furniture, bags, uh, anything, just anything. We have, oh my goodness, look at all of this stuff in this room. Kind of, <laughs> there is a lot of things, just a lot of things. A lot of things, wow, yes. stuff, wow. A lot of things. Okay, can I say I have a lot of... Okay, I have a stuff in my desk. A lot of stuff on my desk. A, on my desk or in stuff. my desk. 
all my desk, right? <laughs> yes, yes. If you have a lot of things on your desk, you can say, oh, I have a lot of stuff on my desk. Or if, you right. have, or if you have drawers, right, in your desk, you can say, ooh, there, there is a lot of stuff there. Okay. <laughs> I'll do right. that. I like this word. Okay. Um, let me see that receipt. Receipt is like some past, 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 past tense to receive? No, 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 no. A receipt, a receipt is when you go shopping, you buy something, you purchase something, and the the clerk gives you the receipt that is that says, yes, okay. yes, yeah, oh, which says okay. how much money oh. you paid for what you bought. Let me see that receipt, right? Yes, I and we pronounce see. this word, we pronounce it receipt. Okay, receipt. Uh -huh, without P, receipt. Rec ah, receipt. Wow. Cool. Hey, I only bought the essentials. Okay, let's see. Dog food. $24 and 70 blah, 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 blah. One more time. Okay, let's see. Dog food. $24.70. We don't even have a dog. Well, it was going to be a surprise, but look in the back of the truck. Wow, well, I like your what? <laughs> okay. All right. What is that? Ha 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 ha. <laughs> it's uh, he's laughing. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. All right. Uh, speechless. What is speechless? Is it like the word speech? A discourse? Oh, shut up. Kind of no words. Kinda. Like there is nothing else that I can add. I'm speechless there is nothing else that i can say i'm speechless oh it's speechless okay i knew you'd love him that thing that dog's as big as a horse he probably eats like one too ah but he's sure friendly and someone was giving him away at the mar supermarket and i i i <laughs> I, 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 it's like me. Couldn't let that poor thing pass another day without a loving home. Yeah, whatever. Where was I? Eighteen dollars and nineteen cents for twenty-four cans of tomato juice. You don't even like that stuff. Ah, uh, not yet. I've decided to change my eating eating habits. Right, right. You will see. You see? You see? Okay, let's see. Three eighty-four for a box of chocolate cookies and twelve fifty-six for a case of soft drinks. And that's your phrase. When you see that kind of phrase in the brackets, it's your phrase. Because when she speaks, he says some things too. All right, I need to read. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, okay. that's his phrase. Yeah, changing your it, it, No, that is fine. Your yours is only oh, in the sorry, All right, okay. Always oh, sorry. I'm sorry. Let me yeah. let me start. Let, let me start my phrase again, okay? And then then you will add your in inner phrase. So, okay, let's see. Um, three eighty four for a box of chocolate cookies and twelve fifty six for a case of soft drinks. <laughs> you say yeah. I'm sorry. Well, we, we are here. We are here. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Uh, 384 for a box of chocolate cookies and 1256 for a case of soft drinks. Yeah. Changing your eating habits, huh? Do you really think that cookies are some type of a diet food? Hey, I would just eat a cookie or two every other hour. In fact, they are a great source of carbo. Carbohydrates? Oh, help me, please. Carbohydrates. Carbohydrates. Yes, carbohydrates. So it's. Carbohydrates. Okay. So it's yes. one of several substances, such as sugar, for example, that provide yeah, the body with energy. For my body, mm -hmm. because I want to be in shape. I know uh, the right rice have carbo carbohydrates. 
hydrates, carbohydrates. Yes. Okay. Yeah, sugar bonds, etc. Hey, all right. Okay. Uh, hey, I will just eat a cookie or two every other hour. In fact, they are a great source of carbohydrates for mm -hmm. energy. And you see the tomato juice, juice and the cookies kind of, you know, cancel each other out. Oh, brother, I can't believe what I'm hearing. Let's see, where was I? A carton of eggs, 250 for a gallon of milk, three cans of tuna, okay. Finally, just steaks for 814. Now something worth eating. I'll get the grill started. Oh, we, uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> the steaks are for Herbert. Herbert? Who's Herbert? Mm, he's the dog. No. You see, the previous owner said that he's kind of, he's somewhat picky mm -hmm. about what he eats. No. And the, the steaks might help him adjust. Absolutely not. No, 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 no. And the steaks might help him adjust to his new home. Hey. What are you doing? Oh, no. Why did you throw the stakes out on the ground outside? Well, now you and Herbert can get to know each other better. I'm going out to eat by myself. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I, need to, I need to learn about the expressions, the sound expressions right in English. Because, for example, in Portuguese, wow, you, a, L. Wow. But it's not the same in English. <laughs> okay. Yeah. By the way, these dialects are so good in terms of learning these expressions. They have a lot of expressions like that. Yeah. So, um, are there any other words that you don't know? Let's read the vocabulary yeah. and sample sentences. Do you yeah, see the vocabulary? Read the Let's read them and discuss them. I'll read and you'll repeat. Okay. okay. First one. Give someone a hand. That's an idiom. Give, give someone a hand. Mm -hmm. Let's read what it means. Help someone, especially with something that requires physical work. I star, employ. And that's an example. Okay. I star, employ, uh, give, my, give my mom a hand to load the groceries in the car. Okay, a store employee, employee is a person who works. One more time, just repeat this uh, word, employee. Employee. Good, good, good. Employee, good. all right. Employee. A store employee gave my mom a hand. So basically a store employee helped my mom to load the groceries in the car, to okay. pack them, to put them into the car. The yes. next word. Groceries, mm -hmm. food, and the other things sold at a supermarket. For example, she bought she, she bought some groceries for the tonight's party. Yeah, groceries. Do you buy groceries every day or every other day? Uh, three times per week. Okay, all right. Yes. Okay, let's continue. The next word, stuff. Stuff. Types of things, singular or plural. Mm -hmm. You can buy that stuff at any grocery store. Okay, yeah, you can buy that stuff. You can buy anything. You can buy that thing or that stuff. You can buy yeah. that stuff at any grocery store. Mm -hmm. Like, I need to buy a board game. Okay, you can buy that stuff in that store, for example. Mm -hmm. Anything. Okay, the next word. Receipt. 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 Okay. A small piece of paper that shows what you bought at a store. You need the... Okay, the phrase, right? You need the receipt to return that stuff to the store. Otherwise... They want to refund your money. Sometimes. Okay, so I had a situation once in the States. 
I bought some trousers, I don't remember. And they, I didn't like the color and I had to give them back to the store. So I went to the store, I bought them at Costco and, and I, I showed my receipt and they gave me money back. For example, you bought a book and for a reason you want to give it back and take your money back. So you go to the store, you show them the receipt saying, this is the receipt that proves that I bought this, but unfortunately I don't need it. So I would like to, I would love to give it back. I'll show you the receipt and you give me my money back. So I give them the book back and they give me my money back. That's what a refund is. Let me ask you, refund okay. is like this book, the cost of this book is um, $2, okay? $2. You, I am the salesman, and you want to buy my book, two dollars, and you give me, uh, you you give me in this moment five dollars. I will refund you three dollars. No, yes? no, 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 no. It's not a change. It's not a change. Not change. That you're saying is a change. I pay for this book five dollars, and you give me three dollars change, and a wow. refund is that show show me that book again is that i bought your book i bought it and now i say marcelo i would love to give this book back to you can you give me my money back i paid two dollars uh, all right yeah okay. i paid two dollars for this book so you give me two dollars and i return the book all right yeah very good perfect let's continue essentials essentials and say essentials the most need things you can buy all of the essentials for your trip in the section of the mall okay so the things that you need the most very uh well yeah basically the things that you need the most those are essentials the most important things because in your list right oh, in your list when you're writing a list when you go to the supermarket you say well i need to buy this 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 and this for sure now I don't need this, but I can buy that. So, but so the essentials are the most important things in your list when you go to the supermarket or when you go to the market or anywhere. They're just the candy. most important things. Candy, for example, is not an essential thing. No, right? candy is not an essential for us. No. <laughs> whereas, whereas, whereas for children, <laughs> probably. Yes, yes, but it's not. It's, yes, yes, we're right. <laughs> <laughs> However, it's not healthy for children. Not healthy, yes. Okay. Is speechless. Speechless. Uh huh. Speechless. Okay. Unable to speech because you are angry. Angry or unhappy or happy, unhappy. or surprised. Embarrassed. It doesn't matter. It's just different situations. Sometimes you just you don't want to. <laughs> there is a situation that you. You just can't say anything because you can't find words for describing that situation. And you're like, oh, I'm speechless. I can't say a word. Mm -hmm. All right. Yes, it's my is the is the first time I am seeing this uh, word. I miss it, this word. Yes, yeah, speechless. Yes, yeah. but speechless. Uh, we, we can remember about speech, right? Mm -hmm. Speech is about talking a lot. Yeah. Speechless is talking less. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And uh, let's read this phrase, example. Right? Mm -hmm. Yes. His be behavior, his yeah, behavior, behavior. Mm -hmm. left me speechless because he spent so much without talking with his wife. Give away. Give away, give something without selling it, especially when you do not need it anymore. The phrase for the example, the store was giving away free samples of free chicken. Fried, fried chicken. Fried chicken. Okay. Okay. Just give right. away, give it for free. The next word, yeah. what, whatever, whatever. Whatever. Use it when you don't care what the person says. Mm -hmm. I have problems with words. As uh, sometimes I thought, 
I think Pearson or Person? It's Person, person right? Person, Person. Person mm -hmm. says, yes. Are you really going to eat all that ice cream? Sure. Why not? Whatever. Um, I told you before that you want to lose weight that way. But you never listen to me. I'm done giving your advice. There is a dialect. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next word, case. Case. A large box or container in which things are sold or stored. Example. Case. Could you, could you pick up three cases of chicken soup? I thought we could give some away some away to family and friends who really need it. Mm -hmm. All case. right. Right, cases. Right, case. In this case, right? Well, yes, this word has a lot of meanings in different situations when you use it, it sometimes it can have a different meaning. But yeah. in this case, in this case, in this situation, this case, yes, this in this case, right? In this situation, we can use it as a noun. So a case, it's like a box, right? A case, a container, mm -hmm. like a container, of right. something. All right, the next carton. word, car carton, carton. Carton, yes, I, I remember cartoon, but it's not cartoon. Yeah. <laughs> carton, carton. A small cardboard box that contains food or drink. She drank a small carton of juice. For example, a cardboard, a cardboard is a thick, hard paper that is used for making boxes. And when we're talking about juice, sometimes juice is sold in bottles, like glass bottles. Sometimes juice or milk even uh, is sold in carton carton packages. Oh, okay. All right. The next word is adjust. 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 To adjust. Just. That's a verb. To adjust. Oh, to adjust. Okay. Get used to a new situation. Example. It often takes time to adjust to new foods. It often takes time to adjust to new foods. It takes time. It really, I need more time to get used to eating something new. I used to eat sweets, but right now I don't eat them anymore. And it takes time for me to adjust, to get used to this new situation in my life where I don't eat sweets anymore. Or another example, I live in Ukraine, I live in Kiev, and for example, um, I'm flying to your country. I'm visiting you and there is a time difference, right? Six hours of difference. And I feel a little bit dizzy and sleepy and I say, oh, Marcelo, I need some time to adjust to water that is there, to adjust to new circumstances, to adjust to the culture. To adjust means to get used to, to get used to new things in life or in a different, when you are in a different situation, you say, Oh, just uh, I need to, I need some time for myself because I need to get used to this situation. Ah, to solve a problem? Not to solve a problem, just to feel more comfortable in, new, in a new situation, right? Because you say, um, to, so basically to adjust means to change the way you behave or think mm -hmm. because you want to be more comfortable in a new situation. Um, for example, for example, again, they found it difficult to adjust to a life, to, to, to adjust to their life in a different country because they don't know the language and they have to learn the language of that country or they have to adjust to the culture. Do you have a dictionary? <laughs> yes, I have. <laughs> Okay. I have two dictionaries. <laughs> oh, the one that I bought. <laughs> Let me create a phrase. And, uh, okay, I say I would just my microphone to uh, to you to hear my voice better. That's right. Yeah, I have to adjust my microphone. Adjust. Yes. All right. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, so that was really fun. Okay. Thank you so much. Yes. 
All right, Sasha. I think that this, this dialogue is very advanced for me. <laughs> But I like to learn new words because that word is very necessary for my vocabulary. It's very necessary. It's... I agree with you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much for willing to learn. And I'm very Thank happy you. that uh, I can help you.